Model-based definition, or MBD, defines within a CAD model the information necessary to align, machine, and inspect manufactured parts. This encapsulation of part data in a single file simplifies manufacturing and ensures consistency through all phases of the manufacturing process. The use of CAD models enables programming and machining in a digital workflow, which improves efficiency and eliminates transcription errors and out-of-date drawings. Geometric dimensioning and tolerancing, or GDNT, is used to specify the acceptable level of error in a machined part. These tolerance limits are carefully designed to minimize production cost and still produce an acceptable part. In this step, we'll use Verisurf's MBD tools to add datums and datum targets, as well as surface profile tolerance and GDNT callouts such as position and perpendicularity to our elbow model. Verisurf MBD is associative, which means it becomes a property of the model features that other functions and software can recognize. We'll start by defining datums to control how the part is set up on the mill and how the inspection device is aligned to the part. We create datum labels by selecting datum features in the model. We can also add labels to other control frames that reference datum features. We then use datum targets to identify where to probe each datum feature. Next, we'll add callouts to control flatness and perpendicularity of the rectangular flange faces, followed by position tolerance on the hole pattern. We'll then add profile tolerance callouts to the inner and outer tube surfaces and the circular flange faces. Finally, we'll control the size and location of the flanges using position callouts. This addition of MBD communicates the design intent and the required level of accuracy to the part programmer, the machinist, and the inspector. 